Hey, what's up guys? JakeMTG here, and we're going to be going over a deck called Esper Stacks that ended up winning the Phantom Legends Tournament on September 26th, and the uh, person that made the deck was Brian Gottlieb. I'm sorry if I, you know, botched your last name, but congrats, Brian. And this deck is just so much fun to play. Um, it's a, you know, stacks deck with uh, Doom Foretold, and uh, this card is just absolutely broken. Um, so I'll tell you what it does. Let's pull it up. So Doom Foretold, at the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player sacrifices a non-land, a non-land, a non-token permanent. If that player can't, they discard a card, they lose two life, and then you draw a card, you gain two life, and you create a 2-2 white knight token with vigilance. Then you sacrifice Doom Foretold. So if they have no other permits they can sacrifice, you do all that, you make a knight, they discard a card, you draw a card. And then, But if they do have a permanent, they sack it. And then it goes to our turn, and then we sacrifice one of our golden eggs, our globes, stuff like that. Do we want to fill up our graver with all these artifacts and enchantments in order to play Dance of the Mans? Oh, Mains, I can't even say the name right. But um, for X mana, we can bring back target artifacts or enchantments that cost X or less. So, uh, the, But the, we wanted to do this for six or more, because if we do it for six or more, those permanents also become four for creatures, in addition to the other types. So we um, can bring back golden eggs, gloves. When they come on back, we also draw cards. Same thing with Othakai. We're going to be able to ping them for three, and we gain three. So um, yeah, let's go ahead, and we'll play, play the game. Yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video of you guys just got back from uh, TwitchCon, and it was a ton of fun meeting a bunch of streamers that I get to uh, connect the voice to the face if they're not uh, streaming with a you know face cam. But yeah, it was it was a ton of fun. Uh, good luck to Hobo Jackal. Hopefully, we'll get a good hand. Let's see what we got. Um, yes. Um, yeah, we can play two globes to draw cards, and our opponent gets to go first, so we'll go ahead and we'll keep the seven. We also got our board wipe if we need to do any of that. Okay, we might be playing against Bant Flash, which is a bad matchup for this deck, from what I've been seeing. Have this enter tapped. Say hello to our opponent. Okay. Let's go ahead and play a globe. We get to draw a card. Unless they somehow counter it. <laughs> the music for that is pretty cool. Okay, we drew another dance. Okay. So let's see if we can get a land that comes in untapped. If not, we'll just play another globe. Okay. We're at 18. Um, so what? We can do this for... Three mana, destroy that if we want to. Hmm. I think we're just going to go ahead and play another globe. Get to draw a card. Okay, we got a wrath. Okay, so let's go ahead and play this tapped. We'll go ahead and we'll pass the turn. Okay, they're playing a sailor. They get to pay two. Turns to a 4-4, four, four, huh? Yep. So they can swing for 5. That's really rough, huh? Okay. Sure. Um, let's go ahead. Do this for a rider. Let's destroy this. Let's see if it's, it's countered or not. So it does get mystic. Okay. Sure. Okay. Let's go ahead and play a Temple of Silence. And we'll go ahead and scry. Um, one, two, three. Let's, yeah, let's go ahead and leave that on top. Hopefully they don't have another frilled mystic. Because that would hurt us a lot. So they can swing for seven, eight. Okay. Okay, we're at five, huh? Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can um, if we can board wrath. Okay, they get to draw a card. Let's go ahead and board wipe them. Go ahead, play a passage, 
and we'll pass the turn. Sure. Okay. He can plus. Okay. Let's go ahead and fetch. We'll go ahead and get an island. And what we can do is we can play our Tailsman if we get another land. Oh, I got a, huh, I got a plane, so I shuffled, I did it too fast. Okay. Okay, we got a Doom. They could flash stuff in, though. Let's go ahead and try it. If they don't have anything they can flash, then we are going to be okay. Let's go ahead and pass. Okay, they're going to flash that in. Okay. I'll keep. They can either choose to sacrifice something. Let's see what they sacrifice. Oh, they sacrifice that. Okay. Sure. Okay. We're at three. Okay. Let's go ahead and sacrifice this. Let's go ahead and play an egg. Go ahead and draw a card. Okay, it is a Godless Shrine. We'll go ahead and play this tapped. Um, we'll go ahead and we'll pass the turn. Okay, they bring in a Vandal. Okay. Uh, resolve all. Okay. Get the to choose to sacrifice. Okay. Let's go ahead, gain three life. Okay. Let's go ahead, sacrifice here. Let's go ahead, play a Talesman. Let's go ahead, crack this. Go ahead and get a Teferi. Let's see if this Teferi resolves. It does. Okay. Go ahead, bring this back. We get to draw a card. This go ahead and that sacrifice, and they scooped. Okay, so we got the first game. I'm surprised we did because this is a really bad matchup for us. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If you haven't liked the video yet, um, it really helps me grow and allow me to make more videos for you guys. And if you want to keep up to date with all the deck techs and gameplays, I would suggest hitting that subscribe button for more future content. Thanks so much. Now, let's get back into the video. Um, let's go ahead, get a disfigure, a Legion's End. What else do we want? I think that's it, huh? Um, and then we can take out a planar cleansing, and we can take out do do do. Um, let's take out a veto. Let's just have him counter our stuff. <laughs> okay. All right. Good luck to our opponent here. Um, this is something we can keep. Okay, we're going to be doing the same thing playing our Temple of Silence. Go ahead, play this. Go ahead and scry. Um, we'll leave that on top. So it's going to have an extra Teferi against this deck. Um, let's go ahead, play this tapped, and we'll go ahead and pass the turn. Sure, play Cutthroat, okay. Sure, they're shocking, okay. Let's see what they do next. All right, opponent, what do you want to do? Okay, 
So, let's try to go ahead and play this to fairy. See if they flash anything in. Okay, sure. Let's go ahead. Minus three there. Draw card. So now we know they have two. We can Legion send that. But we keep drawing lands, huh? Okay. They're going to go ahead and attack the Teferi. Okay. Sure. Let's go ahead. Hmm. Let's go ahead and play a Godless Shrine tapped. I'll play a Talesman. And we'll go ahead and we'll pass the turn. We're going to flash something in. Sure. Okay, resolve all. Okay. Sure. Swing it for seven at us. Okay. Okay. Huh. So this is kind of annoying, huh? Well, we're going to have to look for a wrath to stay alive. Let's go ahead and get a Kaya's Wrath. See if this resolves. It does. Okay. They can go ahead and flash that in. Okay. Sure. Brazen Borrower. Okay. Sure. Let's see what they do next. Okay, they did search for something, okay. Okay. Hmm. Let's go ahead and play a passage. Let's go ahead, Legion's in there. Let's see if they play a Frilled Mystic. If they're playing Jumpy for it. Okay, they're going to negate. Okay, that resolves. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and fetch. We can get a Plains. And we'll play a Wrath. See if this resolves. Do they have another negate? They don't. Okay. Okay, they got a cutthroat. Okay. Sure. Okay. Huh. Well, let's go ahead and play it to fairy. See if this resolves. It does. Okay. Let's go ahead and return this back. Um, let's go ahead and play a Temple of Silence. Scry. Um, we'll leave that on top. Um, let's go ahead and pass the turn. So they can only play things on their turn now. Okay. Sure. Um, so we did get a wrath. Hmm. Let's go ahead and plus. What do we 
we got going on in there. So we can do this, play one, two, have four mana, okay. Let's go ahead. Let's get a golden egg. We'll go ahead and play this golden egg. We get to go ahead and draw a card. Okay, um, let's go ahead and play this tapped. And we'll go ahead and we'll pass the turn. Okay, they're going to go ahead and attack the Teferi. Um, we're going to go ahead and board wipe. Sure. Um, let's go ahead play a Swamp. Let's go ahead and plus play a globe. We got a Teferi. Okay, let's go ahead go here. We'll go ahead and keep this one. Let's go ahead minus three here. And we'll go ahead and play a Doom Foretold. All right, so we're keeping our opponent completely locked out almost. And they scooped. We got it. So this is how the stacks deck kind of work. But in the end, we wanted to um, go ahead and muse uh, and bring back all of our artifacts and enchantments. So we beat, yeah, we beat a deck that was super hard for us to handle. Um, so let's go back to the deck. Just want to slowly show you what we got in there so and I'll also be posting the deck list in the description of this video um, so basically uh, we have one Legion Zen one Wish Claw Talesman which is amazing with Teferi that you can go ahead and uh, pay one get search for a card that we need give back to our opponent minus three Teferi return that back to our hand and draw a card it's just it's really gross uh, we have one Dovan's Veto in the main three Thought Eraser four Golden Egg four Guild Globe, two Murderous Rider, four Teferi, four Oath of Kaya, three Doom Foretold, four Kaya's Wrath, one Planar Cleansing, uh, three uh, Dance of the Mains, and then we got our Mana Base. Um, let's go ahead and look at the sideboard as well. We have one Disfigure, we have two Duress, two Disenchant, one Legion's End, two The Elder Spell, two Dovin's Veto, one Cry of Cranium, two Ashiok Dream Renderer, a one unmoored ego and one realm cloak giant so uh, that is esper stacks for you and if you're interested in the deck uh, the link is in the uh, description of this video and you can download it so um, and if you are liking this content that i'm making feel free to um, subscribe and uh, leave a like it really helps me out thank you guys have a good one